What's good, YouTube? It's your boy JLTV. Welcome back to another Rainbow Six Siege video, man. And welcome back to the breakdown. So in this episode of the breakdown, we're going to be breaking down Zero, if you haven't seen by the title. And how to use them, the best way to use them, and more things like that. So uh, what, if you before the video gets started, if you're new to the channel, if, and if you like what you're watching, or you, you've you been watching me for a little bit, you haven't subscribed, go ahead and hit, hit that sub button. It's about 18% of y'all that are subscribed watch my video, and like 70-80% that are unsubscribed so if you're new to the channel go ahead drop us up for me but let's get the video started so first thing i'm gonna go over go over is zero's guns zero's gun he has the this gun right here the sc3 zero's okay and bandit's gun which is the mp7 those those two guns these two guns are really good guns so it doesn't really matter which guns you use it just ba it's based off preference at that point because they're, they're both good guns and it doesn't matter which one you use but with the weapon situation done, I'm going to be explaining to you guys how to use Zero. So Zero, you can use him in many different ways. You can use him to help get the wall. And when that, what that means is bring a Thermite into Zero or a Bond of Heart. Just bring a Heart Breacher, help get the wall, go like that. And you take out the Bandits or the Kaido or whatever it is here. That's that's one of the ways you can use Zero. Or, you can't pick these up, can you? No, you can't. Okay, so one of the other ways you can use zero, you can play vertical and and try to do some things with there. I know um, zero doesn't have uh, uh, breaching charges, but you use one of his cams, put it in the floor, and basically play vertical. And you can use this to see people who are like maybe there's an echo or somebody who's just on their cams, and you can basically just find them, put a point on them, ping them. And shoot them through the full ass. That's one of the things you can do when you're attacking a zero. And yeah. And one of the great things about zero is that you can also use him to watch flanks. Oh, let me let me find it. Like you can use him to watch flanks when it's late round. And you can have tell your teammates to watch the flank or or just watch his cams in general. Because you can you can hold considering that he comes with three of his um Argus launchers, you can watch three different uh, flanks, rotations, anything, or even watch put a cam in sight for when they try to uh, when y'all plant the bomb. But those are the ways you can use Zero. You can also use him as a um, thermite breacher himself because he he also has I don't have it right now, I have Claymore, but he has that um that circle breaching thing. I think I know what I'm talking about, but it's it's basically another breaching charge, but it breaches the re uh, reinforcements. But um yeah, Zero is a great op operator for you to use because he can he can do a lot of things. He can do vertical. He can watch flanks. He, he has great guns. He can go and frag. He's one of those versatile operators that can do a lot with little things. Well, little things. I mean, like he has a gun and a gadget. It's not like he has more than that. But if you, I hope you guys enjoy this video on how to use Zero. If you're new to the channel, you know what I'm saying. I already said in the beginning, so I ain't gonna say it again. But hope you guys enjoyed this video. And it's Jobby. And I'm out. Red bone, cello, light skin, yellow.